Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. This time I'm going to be trying to do 100 days of hardcore Minecraft. So if you didn't know, people have been doing this where they have been trying to play, like I said, 100 days in survival Minecraft or hardcore Minecraft or modded Minecraft or whatever. This is my first attempt. I don't know if I'm gonna do any more. I might do it. I might win. I don't know yet. Well, actually, I do know the results, but you don't know yet. So anyways, let's get into it. Day one. So basically, in day one, I lit up my island, got wood, coal, and a bed. And you know, just some basic stuff. Like here, look at me. I'm just placing down torches for like basically the entire day around my island. And of course, getting some sheep. Okay, day two, I got some more wood, melons, pumpkins, and I started working on my base. Not much really happened in these first few days, but you know, it's nice to show what I did. On day three, basically all I did was work on my house, which I think looks pretty nice so far. Here's just a little time lapse of what I did. It's not the best thing, but you know, it's it's just something to work with, and it's definitely not finished, especially the root. And then on day four to five, I was just mining. I did this off camera since it's basically just mining, but I got irons and a couple of diamonds. Anyways, on day six, I crafted some more armor and a shield and some other things. And guess what happened? That's right. On this day, day six, I went exploring and found two shipwrecks, which honestly is definitely a win. That is great. Like, look at here in at this one. It was just filled with sand and dirt, and I had to just dig through to find the three chests. And sadly, there wasn't any diamonds, but there was a bunch of stuff. But you know what's very peculiar? The buried treasure map that I found on one. So I checked on the next day, which was day seven, and I actually mined it about one chunk away. So basically up in the F3 screen, you can see nine, nine. That's how I find the buried treasure, but I did it one or two chunks off from the actual buried treasure so but i did actually find the buried treasure but then i checked on the map and i went to the right spot and it also had buried treasure too so i found two and that was just crazy i don't know what my odds were on that on the same island i spawned at with sparse jungle which is one of the most rare biomes ever by the way, I definitely did not choose a seed. It was just random seed. I don't know how this happened. Anyways, on day 8, after I got back up from my bed, I started going exploring again. This time, I wanted to get some obsidian and hopefully maybe find a village. So luckily, I did find a rune portal. I just basically got all the obsidian and stuff from the chest in there. There wasn't too much stuff and there was enough obsidian that I needed. Oh yeah, and look at this. I also found a dungeon. I was gonna go in it and I was like, eh, should I? Because right then I only had iron armor and I tried to go in, but then I got scared by a spider. Anyways, then I started keep going and I found a village, which was really nice. And also after getting into the village, I went to see in the middle, there was a giant hole with a blacksmith in the middle. And in the blacksmith, there was a total of three diamonds. And I was so happy about that. But then after that, I just got some hay bales. And then on the next day, I just went back, which was day nine. That's basically all I did, just go back. That's about it. Except I did actually loot the dungeon and there wasn't much stuff though. Then basically once I got back on day 10, I finally finished my house with a roof and all. And I need you guys to rate my house. Do you think it's good? Do you think it's not good? Tell me in the comments down below. On days 11 to 13, I did actually record myself finding diamonds and other things like that, going mining. And so here's a few of the diamonds that I did find. And so I think, I got quite a bit from day 11 to day 13. I got really lucky and I got 27 diamonds in those few days. I was looking to be on a good roll. I thought I was gonna beat this challenge since now I got full diamond armor. And oh yeah, and on one, I got 
a vein of eight. I thought it was maybe a couple, but then I mined one and saw that there was more, and it looked like it might have been an eight vein. So then I recorded it, and yeah, it was eight. But then next on day 14, I just crafted diamond armor and farmed, got some melons, got some pumpkins, started planting wheat and other stuff like that. And on the topic of farming, actually, guess what happened? On day 15, I got some cows because I need leather for my books or my bookshelf or my enchanting table that I got on day 14. But then also on day 15, I also set up my nether portal finally, but I did not light it because I wanted to do that maybe at like day 30, maybe day 25 or so. I went AFK, I made myself a little AFK box because I wanted my wheat and my cows to grow and stuff and i needed to breed them so i would check on it check up on it every so often and i got a couple of bookshelves off of that and that was from day 16 to day 20. you may be able to tell that there is not much time left in this video is it because i died or is it because there's a part two stick around to find out because now we're moving on to Day 20 and onwards. Okay, now on day... I put the wrong file in my folder. Sorry, there has been an unforeseen thing. If you can hear me, because I am I was being stupid and I want to leave this in the video, I just put a different Minecraft video in my folder for my 100 days. What is this? <laughs> I'm watching my own recording. <laughs> oh my gosh, I didn't know I could do this. <laughs> I'm watching my own recording that I'm watching now. <laughs> Wait, here, here, watch my live reaction of me watching my video in, in LC. Oh, why is it so contrasty? We're getting a chain. We're getting a chain going, guys. Here, here, watch my watch my live reaction. But yeah, me watching my me watching my video. Oh, there's a lot of contrast there. Whoa, foreign foreign guy. Okay, we're going. We're going. We're going. How to, how to get up? <laughs> okay, I'm out. I'm out. I'm out. Day 21. Basically, on day 21, I just farmed and then traveled to the village once again because i wanted to start using my villagers start like trading with them so then i can get like better enchantments better stuff and that's basically all i did for that day getting the fletching table ready and basically on the whole next day of 22 i traded with my villagers got some emeralds by selling sticks it was very awesome up until day 23 I was trading again, I was getting more like wood and stuff. Sadly, one of the zombies killed my villager, just turned into a, a zombie villager. I wasn't I wasn't gonna help him. So I just killed him. But then later in day 23, I was trying to set up one of the other villagers. And so I was trying to get another villager. There was one on a side of a cliff that I wanted to go to, you know, because I mean, he was unemployed, so why not? So I was bridging over and I made it to him. I made it to him and then I got back and realized that I just told a lie. I somehow accidentally clicked the control key to the shift key, so I died. But look at my reaction. Look at my look at my reaction time though. Just just watch it. I was so close to getting that water bucket clutch. I was like 0.1 second off. It wasn't actually the timing that was off. It was that, oops, guess what? I was on the edge of a block. I'm gonna replay it and replay it slower. Just watch this. I accidentally controlled and then that was a pretty good clutch, not gonna lie. If it wasn't on the edge of a block. Anyways, if you could not tell, there's gonna be no part two, and that's it. 
I only made it to day 23. I might try again. So I think you should like and subscribe. So then you can see the next video if I do post one. But if you like this video, then go check out my other ones. Anyways, you don't have to do that. If you didn't like the video, you can always dislike. I like feedback. So anyways, like, so anyways, bye guys. See you in the next video where hopefully, anyways, goodbye gay. Gay. Anyways, goodbye. <laughs> anyways, goodbye guys. Uh, with those bloopers out of the way, bloopy bloopers, I'd like to say goodbye. See you in the next video. Goodbye. Peace out. I don't know. Just, just bye.